President William Ruto has directed that 80% of future recruitment to all security agencies must come from the National Youth Service. The president says this will bolster inclusivity and enhance diversity in the security services. Meanwhile, President Ruto has affirmed the government's commitment to ending banditry. The National Youth Service will be given priority in future recruitments by security agencies have resolved to enhance diversity and inclusion by expanding enrollment in the National Youth Service as an agency to capture young people at the bottom of the pyramid. Consequently, we are doubling enrollment to 40,000 yearly in the National Youth Service. The head of state said the government has moved leaps and bounds to ensure the country is secure from internal and external aggression. The reason why Kenya has continued on the path of steady progress is that we have maintained stability, peace and security by affirming our territorial integrity and maintaining internal tranquility. Acknowledging that there are still some challenges facing the security sector, the president said there is no room for complacency. Therefore, taken firm and decisive measures to deal with the challenge of banditry, armed crime, cattle rustling, and other forms of impunity in all parts of the country, beginning with a successful security operation to restore calm in the North Rift. We have been systematic, focused, thorough, and relenting and totally committed to removing for good all threats to lives and livelihoods of Kenyans. The government has spent the better part of last year dealing with runaway insecurity in part of the Rift Valley, where banditry has made life unbearable for residents. To effectively tackle the challenges bedeviling the security sector, the head of state said the focus must also be placed on dismantling corruption cartels, feeling disunity in different parts of the country.